What's up, Team Ty Dog? It's your girl Ty, and I'm back again with another video for Vlogmas Day 11. Oh, it is the month of Ty Simber, and we're going back to back to back to back with these videos. So, in today's video, I'm gonna be telling y'all my turn ons and turn offs. I just put this poll on Instagram, y'all voted for it, and we're gonna get right into it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Most importantly, hit that subscribe button so you can become Team Thai Dog. Okay? Alright, let's get into it. Okay, turn on number one. A boy with hair. Braids, twists, waves, size cut. A boy with just a clean ass haircut, y'all. That is the turn on pick. Mmm, mmm. And when I say boy, y'all, just disclaimer, I'm talking about 18 plus, like, we don't do blue boys no more, you know. Number two, a boy who wear earrings. I think, not them big ass, like, blocks, like, this shit so out of style. I'm talking about, like, little small, you know, nice size earrings that be, ask me out, ask me out. <laughs> My next turn on, a boy who got something going for themselves. Slash got some money, okay? I'm talking about if you in school, if you like got goals or wanna better yourself, if you got a job, if you not broke, if you got some money in your pocket, then that's a turn on like you can't we can't mess with these broke niggas like no. We leaving them alone. This y'all last month, this is the last month y'all got. 2018 is y'all last month. Next year y'all out of here. Another turn on. A nigga who can cook, like I love to eat. If I'm talking to a go with or date a nigga who cook me food or buy me food, but more definitely cook me food, then baby, you is just, that's a plus. Cause like, you can cook and you cook for me. And that's sweet, cause they let me know that you care if I eat or not. <laughs> a boy who could dress, like, if you can dress yourself, if you know how to look good and clean and baby, then that's just a turn on to me, like when you just got a nice fit on. I'm talking about you ain't wearing no off brand, everything. And it ain't gotta be designer. Like, if you just got on some nice clothes, nice pants, I love boys who wear nice jeans. Like, that is a turn on. Jeans, a boy who wear jeans and sweatpants. Ooh. My next turn on is a guy who holds the door for me. If I'm with you, I bet I never had to touch not one door. Now, if I do it, it's like me. Maybe I feel like it wasn't that serious and I, you know, open the door for myself. And I'm not that type of girl who you gotta open the car door for me. Like, no, nine times out of 10, I be ready to get in where we going. So you don't have to open the car door. But if we walk into the mall or walking into a restaurant, I mean, I dare have to put my finger on now, door handle, door knob, like, no. My next turn on, a boy who compliments me about the non-physical things. Like, don't tell me I'm pretty or I look big. Like, the boy say, oh, you're real sweet, you're a nice person, a sense of humor, you funny. Like, a boy who compliment me on, you know, not my physical appearance, but stuff like my personality, that's the turn on, like, I like that. My next turn on, a boy who can hold a conversation. If you can talk to me, about serious stuff, like you really want to get to know me instead of just trying to get with me, then that is a turn on. Like, I really, really like that. My next turn on, y'all, this is a real, real big one. A boy who is supportive, like who likes the things I like, or if they don't like the thing I like, they still try to support me and they talk to me about it and they interested in what I'm interested in. Y'all, that is a turn on. Like, a, a person who you know, like, is just there for you and going have your back and support you that that's the turn on for me another turn on if a guy smells good got on some good ass cologne deodorant smell nice or if you just smell clean and like when i hug you i'm just like y'all that is a turn on like i love a guy who smell good like we don't want <laughs> all right y'all another turn on that i got a boy with thick eyebrows oh Y'all, I love thick eyebrows. I feel like thick eyebrows on a boy is just like a masculine thing. You know, like, when they mad, then the eyebrows be like, I don't know how, but 
<laughs> they eyebrows just make their face. I just love a boy with thick eyebrows. Like, that is just so sexy to me. Some thick eyebrows. And some long eyelashes. A boy with some long eyelashes, y'all. It's just like... Let me, let me just stare in your eyes. And like, when you talk to me and I'm just looking like here, like. My last turn on, my last turn on. A nigga that take me out on dates and show me off. That is my biggest, biggest turn on. Like, you don't want to just have me in your house. You ain't just trying to get in my pants. You like want to be seen with me. Like you taking me out on dates, like shopping. Like y'all, that is a turn on. Like. <laughs> Now for turn offs, okay? My first turn off is a boy who flex, who flex pistols and guns on social media. That is my biggest turn off. I don't wanna click on your Instagram page and you got a gun. Could that mean like if I be with you, then my life is in danger. Like I gotta watch my back when we go out. S -s Slash that, I hate a boy who posts, only thing they post is, like, I don't care if you smoke, like, baby, smoke your weed. If you just post smoking videos all day, why you not getting to your bag? My next turn off, a boy with low hygiene, dirty teeth, colds in your eye, dirty shoes, dirty clothes, your hair don't stay cut, that is a turn off to me. Like, you don't care about your appearance at all whatsoever. My next turn off, a cocky ass nigga. A nigga who don't treat you right because they just think they can have any girl they want. They so disrespectful. Like, just think you got it all. Like, you can't be touched. Like, there's no one better than you. So, you treat other people wrong. I hate that. Like, point blank. Next turn off, when you a nigga who just kept. Like, you just lie. You can't keep it real with me, and I know you lying, and you be trying to have more than one girl at a time and stuff. Like, no. Another turn off. If you just go to jail, you go to jail one time, like something happens. Sometimes people do be at the wrong place at the wrong time. You in and out of jail, in and out of jail. For one, you in and out of jail. I'm gonna be have to give you money. I'm gonna have to be putting money on your books. Like, you ain't even, you can't even make money for me if you in jail. Two, that means you don't have nothing good going for yourself because you in jail. You in and out of jail. And three, like, I'm not no hold me down jail type of person. Like, I did that before and that's a no. Okay? If you are going to jail, in and out of jail, I'm going to leave. Like, another turn off is when boys sat their pants. Now, me personally, I like when boys' pants are like, not hanging off, but when they not off. You don't want to see no boy his pants off. Hey, y'all. If your pants are like kind of, you know, down, not all the way down, but like, let me see. Like, if you a boy and your like that, then yeah. And they all the way down here. No, I don't like that. Um, I don't like when boys set their pants. It's just like you just so screwed. You came from the hood. You just get too ghetto. Can't bring you home to my parents like that. That's a no. Another turn off. A guy who's just disrespectful. You just call women bitches, hoes. I know these females do be making y'all wanna spaz, but I feel like if you know how to just walk away, like if you can control your temper, then I like that. Hitting girls, that is my biggest heart. If you hit girls, it just make you a whole night. My other turn off, I hate a nigga who just wanna play the game all day. You need to have other interests and hobbies. You need to wanna play sports, write a damn book. I don't care, but I just do not like a guy who sits and just play the game all day. Like, wake up at 11, you still on the game at 11 at night. Like, no, they gotta go. Wanna sit on the game, play the game, play the game. What you doing, playing the game? What you doing, playing the game? I come over your house and you playing the game while I'm there? Baby, you out of here, you gone, no. And my last turn off, y'all. This is like, people gonna be mad at me about this, but I don't care. My last turn off is a nigga who don't have a car. <laughs> like, how you gonna take me out? How you gonna pick me up? Because I don't have a car. So, I'm gonna need for whoever trying to get with me. Um, you gonna have to have a whip because I'm not gonna be getting no Ubers and Lyfts and, uh, and taking no cab for me to see you. No, no, nah, I'm not doing it. You need to have a whip, or if you don't have a car, you need. I need to know that you're working on one, or you gonna be the one giving them Ubers and Lyfts back and forth because, like, yeah, you just gotta have a car, like, to talk to me. Like, I'm not messing with no nigga who like on the bus and stuff. Like, no, because you will not dare see me sit on the bus in the seat next to you. So. 
that was my turn ons and turn offs. These are my opinions. You cannot get mad if I said what I like, what I don't like. This is my channel. If you feel like you have something to say, then make your turn on to our video and keep that stuff over there. But yeah, this is my opinion. So thank y'all so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Become part of Team Ty Doll. And stay tuned for Vlogmas Day 12. Tell that bitch I don't like you. Ain't nothing to it.